All right, so we're going to do a lesson on finding noun stems. This is really simple. There are like three slides for this. If you are looking for more information or practice, you can use the Connect Elutic Grammar Lessons book. There's also a section on it in the Jeff Lear Grammar book. Um, and why we're doing this is we need to be able to find a noun stem to know how to attach postbases. Many of our postbases use nouns, or nouns use postbases, so we need to know how to do this. Uh, here's a picture of a selection of words from the picture dictionary, and these are how they appear. So they appear not in their stem form. All right, so let's find some stems. There are four, or I guess there's five, ways that stems appear in the dictionary. And those four are listed here and then right here. So if it ends in a Q in the dictionary, then the roots, the root or stem, which is, we're using it interchangeably here, um, so a root word or a stem are, are pretty much the same thing. Um, but if a word ends in a Q in the dictionary, then it's going to end in an R. The stem ends in an R. If the dictionary word ends in a K, then the stem will end in a G. If it ends in the dictionary in a TA, then the stem will end in TE. And if it ends in N in the dictionary, then the stem will end in TE. Now, stems that end in A are a little less predictable. Sometimes they end in A, and sometimes they end in E. And I, what I mean here is words that appear in the dictionary ending in A. Um, sometimes they end in A, and sometimes they end in E as the stem. I, I did a typo there. Um, so let's practice. We're going to go to a Word document, and we're going to write the stems for each of the words here. So I pulled the chart into this document and we're going to practice. So a kradak, it ends in a Q, so the stem is going to end in an R. A meek, A M I I, and that's going to end in a G because those, the word ends in a K. Um, and then we have chikluak, and that ends in a Q, so it's going to end in an R. Chukuk, it's going to end in an R as well. Khaluk, same thing. Khaluk, Khaluk, and then Kohsun. Ooh, here's an end N ending word. And that's going to end in T-E. And then Hutaista, T ending, T-A ending. And that's going to end in an E. Okay. And then Iralista. Iralista. Ends in an E. And then Ekasluhsuhta. And that'll end in TE. All right. So I hope that was helpful for you. It seems like pretty straightforward. There's only four combos, um, and then an odd one. Um, and those should help when we're putting together our post bases with nouns.